So in the last two episodes, we got to learn about the nature of like chakra, you know, like the wind, fire, thunder, and all that lightning. And we found out that Naruto's was wind. And right now he's currently doing that training just to simply cut the leaf, right? Get used to it. And he's using so many shadow clones at once. And it's like, of course, he's going to tire him out. He's using literally like 200 of them at the moment. So, yeah, that's definitely going to tire him out. And then, yeah, he just gets all that information back. And then all of those clones that experience, you know, cutting the leaf, it's like, okay, bet. Now, it's going to be commutative. And it's like, yeah, it's just going to all add up, right? So, hey, man. We'll just have to see later on how that's going to work out. Because it's like, yeah, we got to go on some mission now, right? Um, so, you know, you got that, but other than that, I think that's pretty much about it. Yeah, just simply that training and then, you know, just kind of taught me a little bit more about certain things. But other than that, though, if you guys will enjoy this, make sure you like, subscribe, and as you get this reaction started. Yeah, he's currently training right now. Trying to cut that leaf. Yeah, do a little something. What are you doing? Hurry up, will ya? We're gonna leave you behind. Yeah, cut it in half. I can totally train on him. And then really try. Eventually, hey man, just tear the leaf to shreds. And maybe instead of a single leaf, he could do like just multiple at once. Hey, man. Come on, what could be taking Captain Yamato so long? I know, right? I wonder where he went off to. Those bodies came back from the dead. <laughs> they came back from the dead. Yeah, of course, he's getting. Yes. So yeah, that's what we're dealing with. Okay. Is he uh? Does this train? Yeah, I mean, yeah, you can do a little something. Just, yeah, don't use, you know, all those clones and, you know, have some fatigue or nothing. Like, nah. Alright, so yeah, let's see what this mission has for us. <laughs> Naruto, look at him, just scared. Quit trying to scare me. That was a bird. He didn't do nothing. Yo. When a friend is scared or frightened, and then yeah, he still gently place your hand around their shoulder. Let them know they're not alone and show them some tenderness. They <laughs> get he did kind of aggressive. Yes, he's <laughs> this may be tougher than I Yeah, he didn't do it right. He's sort of kind of just like bring him here. Yeah. Nah, that don't sound right. Wait, hold on. That isn't what I meant at all. Thought Silas trying to kiss him. Us being together is too dangerous. Where's soccer? I'm gonna go find her. And then you can. Oh, Dude, that's just a regular animal right there. Yeah, just a boar. Um, look at him causing trouble. All he had to do was just stay put at that, uh, what was it, rendezvous point? Yeah, he's not Naruto if he's not causing some trouble, right? Well, now he actually found something. Okay. So, yeah, what's uh, down there? Spooky. Okay. 
That's some crazy win right there. Beast Wave Palm. Okay. That is something. Okay, got his own um weapon there. Was it claws? Oh just like um Dang, how did I, I forget his name? Yo, uh, Asuma, yeah. I'm like, how did I forget that? So, yeah, he's like, yeah, he would be like a wind user then. Or, yeah, wind type of nature. Sharpening that blade. Yes, wind. Yeah, same as you, right? I kind of like it, like, um, I'm seeing these more nature type of things now, after they taught us. Alright, yeah, get that soundtrack. Let's see. Is he going to use his clones here? Okay, yo! A literal like air type of hand that is cool okay yeah come on Naruto we had literally being able to form a hand like how um well yeah Kakashi's trying to teach him yeah make a form shape out of your chakra Okay, that's enough. Who's that? Okay. Oh, Yamato. Greetings, my brothers from the Leaf Village. I am from the Fire Temple. My name is Chidi. Oh, the Fire Temple. Some sort of misunderstanding about the rendezvous location. So we yeah, let's uh. I already know this is Naruto's new friend right here. Yeah, Nar Naruto's just gonna change him, right? Yeah, let's see how he just changes him. His way of thinking. He's a monk in training. Usually something like that. Sora. Sora? Nice to meet you. So Sora. Naruto, I'm captain of our team. This guy here is Naruto and I'm Sakura. Hello there, my name is Sai. Oh, the same place as his dream. The same exact place. There's a beast inside of here. Wreaking havoc. I've seen this place before. Alright, and then yeah, that's it. So hey yo, wait. Naruto. What's going on here? Yeah, I thought that was it. No, that's still a dream. Ain't no way. Ew, no, bro. What is that? We'll be late for our mission. Hey, Sakura. Yeah. Snap out of it. And another thing. How can you even live in Oh my. How? What? Right in milk? Trash all over the ground? And a cockerel? Yo. It makes it even more messier. Yeah, I think that's uh, it for this. Um, yeah, Naruto, he definitely needs to clean up. That is, like, what? That is not even, like, how do you... What? That's not... Chips? Open chips? Two bags of chips? Two boxes of, what, lunch or something there? Ramen? Then you got a cup, books, trash. That is nasty. I'm sorry, bro. That's like... What? I'm sorry. He, would de he definitely would need to grow up. If his room is looking like this, that's not normal, bro. 
I mean, for some people it may be, but like seriously, that's just like no, because I can't deal with stuff like that. Like, no, my room needs to be neat, absolutely no trash on the ground. Like that needs to be put out somewhere in a trash bin somewhere, right? Not just stuck in the room all day long. Like no, because I know he wasn't gonna take that. It's been probably a whole month, and he hasn't taken that out yet. Um, so, yeah, now we got to see if that dream actually comes true, because whatever was going on, we didn't see Naruto, Sakura, or nobody here, right? It was just a, whatever beast or whatever was going around wreaking havoc, um, and actually, I think that was the Nine Tails, actually, that was the beast, right? Um, I had to go back, but... Yeah, I mean, honestly, I mean, it would raise the question, like, was this in the past or, like, the future that he saw this in? Because, yeah, truly, I wouldn't know, right? Like, what event would really lead up to that? Because, um, yeah, for all I know, that, because... That, this fire temple could just look the same like how it was in the past, right? Or if that was a future dream, well, now we know what's about to happen. Um, but for now, I mean, I guess I'll just say it seems like it was happening probably in the future, right? But yeah, I don't know. But yeah, like I said, I like this. Like, let me see. Had a literal whole, like, um, if I can get a clear... I guess you guys can kind of see it. It's like a like a literal hand or something that came out of his arm. And, yeah, sort of like wind nature, right? Like, I, I like how they're doing that now. You know, we're getting to see a lot more, like, Yamato. Deffy got to learn more about him and his natures. Um, and then, like how we saw with Asuma, he sharpened his blade here to where it's like... Yeah, if that cuts you, you're pretty much over, you know? Pretty much over for you unless you got some type of protective barrier or something, right? Um, or, because Chakra is crazy. Like, you can... Yeah, Naruto could uh, really, um, like, on his hand, make it so it could be defensive. And, you know, if he did get cut, it's like, it's just simply Chakra clashing with each other, like... It wouldn't even tear through. It's like, no, it wouldn't even touch his skin. It's just touching that chakra, right? So that'd be cool. Um, and if anything, yeah, he just literally uses a weapon. And yeah, just yeah, adds his chakra to it. So yeah, there's a lot of things you can do with it. Like walking on that water is just like... Yeah, it was crazy. It's like looking at the... Um, Naruto versus Sasuke fight they were literally lifting themselves up from the water it's like that's that's crazy um then like walking on trees yeah going upside down like there's a lot you can do with it it's just pretty cool it's like yeah if I could have chakra myself I'd definitely be training just to do those specific things right but other than that though, that's it for this episode. So yeah, let's just get on with the next. <laughs> yeah. Instead of saving him. <laughs> still pushing him back. Now they're, they're gonna be good friends at the end of all this. I know they are. Yeah, I'm trying to see what that, um, what's going on with that arm. They come, uh, they're covering that up. Yeah, you have our word. Yeah, we gotta get that, uh, yeah, gotta get them. Can't just let them defile people's bodies like that when they're already deceased. Are they training? Okay, now let's see. What they doing, just with a typical or, yeah, just a typical. Again. Oh no, you can actually see the arm. Okay. It's just bandaged up. 
Yeah, just covered up. Something's off about him. What's okay. I thought there was something completely different there. I can't stand him. Remember? Yo! Now he caught that. Now I can't catch that boy Naruto slipping. Okay. Now let's go. Just straight hands, bro. Oh, okay. Nah, he ain't playing around. Okay. Now you're really starting to tick me off. We're just sparring here. Quit freaking out on Nah, he ain't sparring right now. <laughs> My boy did some cartwheels. Oh, those watchful eyes. Okay. Yeah. Not again. Yeah, people are watching them. Okay. Yeah, see, look, there was just something in his past. No new name for you. No new name. Yeah, we gotta find that out. Why is it to where it's like he loses focus? Where people are staring at him. Just like, yeah, how that people used to stare at Naruto. Like, just really despise him or something, or, like, I don't know. Yeah, look at that. Literal hand, just... Yeah. That would be crazy if it hit you. Are you working on changing the form of your wind chakra too then? To avenge my father's murder. Avenge his father's murder. There we go. Getting to know a little bit something. The patrol bird. One of the tombs. Yo, no way! Literally riding on... What? Not on the... Nah, bro. They're crazy for that. But I think... Is that it? Yep. Nah, bro. Sitting here actually riding on that... Yeah, they're really defiling these uh, bodies and all that. Like, really just messing around with them. Yeah, but... Even if it's just a little bit, we got to learn a little bit from this guy here, Sora. Like, yeah, avenge his uh, was it father's murder, right? So, I mean, we got something. And like I said, he, he's gonna become friends with Naruto. I've seen this too many times already. It's like when Naruto really disagrees with someone or really just does not hit it off with someone at first, literally just with Sai, it's like, oh, look at them now. They're actually on another mission together because <laughs> all I said at the moment back then was at least let's get this one mission done. Y'all can do whatever else later on, but just get this one done. That's all they had to do. But look at it now. It wasn't one and done. Like, we're still going at it. And even if he does find Sai a little bit weird, uh, he's just still learning, right? Trying to do whatever he can right now. Um, but they're fine now. Like, he literally... I mean, like, he doesn't even get angry with Sai anymore. It's like, seriously, he's just fine with him there. So... We got that, and the same thing happening with Sora right here. He seriously didn't like him, um, was already fighting with him, and look at them now. It's like they're already making progress, and, you know, now we're finally getting to know a little bit more about him, you know. 
and you know we still got to find out like why he was so um unfocused yeah just couldn't focus right um didn't have that uh, right mind to do anything when people are just staring at him um so yeah i don't i don't know and yeah what's what's um up with this arm being covered up I mean, I guess, is it because of the jutsu or whatever he's using? That's the only way I can... The only thing I can think of. Because, yeah, he's literally... The only arm that he's bringing out this big hand from is that right. So, yeah, is it just like, yeah, using that continuously, like, damage his arm? Because, yeah, that wouldn't be surprising. Yeah, bringing out something like that. Like, yeah, you don't want to be hit by that or grab... Yeah. But, um. Yeah, that was about it. Yeah, Asuma, yeah, being a part of this as well. Yeah, we're seeing a lot of Asuma lately. And then remember, we still got. If they hopefully show it, I wouldn't even mind looking at that. The mission with Asuma, well, team. You could say Team Asuma. I forgot what team number they were. Yeah, I don't, I don't keep up with that. I only know, like, Team 7, right? Uh, Naruto and them. But, like, I think that's right. Yeah, Team 7, yeah. Um, but, um, Eno, Choji, and um, Shikamaru. What, they Team number 10, I think? I Yeah, I, I do not know. But, um... Yeah, they got their own mission, and we got some more Asuma hopefully there as well. But, um, yeah, let's hope that they're not doing the same thing like Orochimaru, just reanimating those bodies and basically bringing them back to life. Yeah, just, just let them rest in peace, right? Um, but I'm not that... It's about it for this one. So we still got like two more to go. So yeah, I'll just see you guys in the next one. Oh yeah, look at them. Watching in on them. Yeah, and he knows too, doesn't he? Yeah, it's like, I mean, gotta keep him under watch. Yeah, he actually does, doesn't he? Hold all the cards it's like because that um what was it the i think it was assassination list or whatever was in that little um what was it that folder or whatever all those documents and files that um sai gave to orochimaru it's like those were supposed to be like heavily highly classified um and yeah like Apparently, yes, they had to, like, switch up the codes. So, that means he somehow had, like, someone inside helping him out. Like, I don't know what happened, but, like, it was something that happened to where he just got it pretty much easily, most likely, if nobody, you know, caught wind, you know, really just noticed that he got these files or even had them to begin with. So... Yeah, for him to have files like that and no one to notice, it's like, yeah, what else does he have, you know? But, yeah, that's pretty much, yeah, a whole nother story for some other episodes. not where the hidden tombs are. Those coffins the thieves are carrying aren't empty. They'll be heavy. Yeah. No place to hide, but there goes a tomb right there. Out in the open, right? Yeah, it, was it four? Yeah. Couldn't <laughs> see, it was kind of blurry. Hold up. Just saw a little sp small specks moving. And on their own, too. <laughs> nah, as he puts his hand on his head. Yeah, he's taking the lead. That's what I'm talking about. It's like them doing all this. Oh, he was close. But I guess Sora made it. 
But yeah, it's how they become good friends. Was it drilling into the ground? Yeah. But, I mean, yeah, that does raise a question. Why lead them out when it's like you have what you need? It's like y'all could just go, right? I'm not gonna lie, it looks almost exactly like Jiraiya. <laughs> like, yo. With the white hair, the face is like, nah, bro. I know it's not, obviously, but like, still. We got these three as well. Greet him. So I guess trap them. Or sort of set up a trap so they can get the tombs right there next to him. And then now they go fight him. I don't know. I guess lead them out so they really won't have any interference. I'm the one who has to bring it to life. That entire thing's nothing but scribbles on paper until I make it move. What the heck is going on? Yo, what do you just do? Those are a lot more than some scribbles on paper. What? The animation going crazy too. Nah, what? Created all of that. Hey man, Yamato going to step up his game. Hey bro. Out here creating. Like what? And yeah, I'm just playing about Yamato. It's just because uh, he made like a literal waterfall. <laughs> but for real. That wood is crazy, bro. Being able to stop it from just crushing him. Yeah, there it goes. Well, I must say, this is quite an elaborate little trap they set for us. Is this some kind of genjutsu? Just changing the scenery? Yeah, throw a rock, something. Yeah. I bet it's a trap. Well, there's only one way to find out. He must have had so much fun making it, he forgot to put in the part about the trap. <laughs> yeah, I knew that was about to happen. <laughs> he over here messing around and he actually falls down. Oh, there it goes, yeah. Because, like, was there not, like, a literal, basically bottomless pit that they were uh, standing on top of? Okay, yes, yeah, yeah, Sai, he's fine on his bird. Not enough time, yeah. Wasn't able to make it out. Oh, they put a tracking device on her? What was that? You can't escape my masterpiece with a lack of a little jutsu like that. Earth dial, ant lion! Yo! Sinking a man? Dang. Nah, Yamato got that. This is a waste of my talents. Yeah, look at that. Don't mess with that boy Yamato. And I like I actually get to really see him like fight for real. Right, I prefer a more hands on approach. Yeah. And he could just break out of that wood. Okay, he got it that time. I'm not gonna fall for that again. That obviously means that I'm going in the right direction. Ah, uh, no, that was the wrong direction. Yeah, that boulder. He dodged it for now. 
All right, and then that should be it for this one here. Yeah, pretty good episode. Yeah, I like that um animation change. Yeah, I definitely know when the animation is about to go crazy. But um, yeah, all of this from a piece of paper. Like that's what I'm saying. Like these. Well, let me actually see exactly. Cause I think it was a scroll type of yeah sort of like a scroll there so that's what i'm saying like i, I like the use of them because like i get to see like you know what can they really be used for like tintin you know she really utilized them well and like i think naruto with what do you do i think when i don't even want to put it this way but like when datara was sitting on gar's body and i think he pulled out like a shuriken i was like yeah that's pretty fire as well but yeah, the utilization of these scrolls is like, I love it, you know? Just something new and not just straight up, okay, let me use this jutsu or let me use some, do some uh, hand-to-hand -hand combat or use like a kunai or something. Because most of the time, kunai, I'd only see them useful, like, and this is like way back when Shikamaru went against, what was it, Tuyuya? of the i think sound four yeah sound four and he had to just i think yeah with whatever kunai or whatever weapons he had at his disposal he just kept on using them and you know had a strategy strategy with them of course um yeah used them well so i don't only really see like a really good use for like shikamaru yeah he didn't know how to use it well um, something similar to that. But other than that, yeah, kunai, really, I, I don't know. Um, most of the time, I really don't see a use for those or, like, shuriken, right? Unless, you know, you're trying to, like, yeah, counter another one, right? So, like, um, you know, if they got someone hostage or, like, if someone's about to get hit with another kunai, you know, they just simply throw another one and... You know, now, if you can't get to them in time, at least that victim is safe. Um, but yeah, they're, um, what was it, Sora and Naruto's relationship, yeah, that's definitely going to continue to get better. Like, them just competing with each other right here, it's like, come on now, it's like, if y'all say y'all aren't friends or aren't at least acquaintance <laughs> well enough, it's like... Yeah, I don't know what else y'all have to do. But, um... Yeah, so who does uh, Sakura and Sora actually go up against? Because I'm like, there's only three people here, and one of them has to stay behind. So... Yeah, because I already know Yamato's with the uh, one guy right there. Then Sai is what, yeah, well, her right there with the earring on. And then Naruto's with the other uh, lady there. See, I don't know. And yeah, to begin with, they actually had to get him in an open field anyways. Because they wouldn't even be able to do this um, jutsu or whatever to begin with. So, yeah, because they needed kind of a wide range right an open field to just set all of this off and really get them trapped inside see that, that was the only reason just to simply draw them out because it's like you have what you need and i'm pretty sure they probably wouldn't be able to find them doing whatever with the tombs but hey man just can't be too sure right yeah you gotta have that extra um you know, countermeasure, whatever, just have a little something, but yeah, other than that, though, uh, let's see, one more episode, so yeah, I will just get to that episode now. Oh! So yeah, what's it got, like, a crystal type of fist? Yeah. Not even affecting him. At least as well, or at least hardening. Okay. 
So, I mean, kind of similar to uh, Sakura, but, you know, kind of different as well. At least with, like, the fist part, right? Yeah. So, yeah, we got to find out a counter that. You can't run forever. Oh, got him trapped in there. For real? Nah. Can't be, right? Yeah, I know they technically got about the same jutsu there. Earth and then wood. They can at least, well, how could I put it? A hold up? Nah, he's fine up in there, or... Oh no, he's... Wow. Actually gone. Nah, Yamato ain't done right, yeah. Literally mixing in. Yeah, it's cool. But yeah, they can each capture each other, basically. You never overestimate your own jutsu. Always make sure that the job is done. I guess I have no choice. Hey, quick, who is that? It'll be quick, all right. Yeah, it'll be real quick. Hold up. Real quick, I get that. Yo, oh, nah, bro. Switch places with me and Naruto right now. Hey, man. <laughs> you can taste my chakra any day. Oh, I, I'll be a part of that collection. Oh, I can handle that. <laughs> Hold up. Nah. Yeah, by Sasuke, right? Yeah. It's a first kiss he had. He should not have said that. Reaper kiss. He got it all right. Oh, shadow clone. Okay. Of course. Oh yeah. <laughs> and he <laughs> and he experiences that too. Yeah, and remembers. Yeah. Hey man, Naruto, you you wanna switch places real quick? Hey, we don't need no shadow clones, bro. I I get it up close and personal. She can draw. What she wants to change? Yo. So she's literally like actively changing the terrain, making things like crumble down in real life. Like, that's crazy. Yeah, some more rocks come crumbling down, right? Yeah. And then she'll eventually trap him. There it goes. And now he's just stuck down there. Every move you make shows up on the design plans I carry with me. Okay, yeah. Not him. And then there goes a the tracking device. So did he know? Yeah, he knew. Okay, you lead him. Super Beast Scroll. Yeah, Super Beast Scroll. We got her. Spears of Stone. Clever boy, he got away. Oh, what is that? Oh, a spider. Wow. Okay, Sai. 
That is a big one. Yo. What is he making this time? Oh, this just the same beast. Yeah. Oh, yeah, black up. Yeah. Blind him. And then there we go. Oh, like saving her? I guess at the last minute. Is that what he read in his book? He got to come in at the the last minute or something to save someone. Guide to self sacrifice? Yeah. It's been a help to me. And then to endear yourself to people, nothing works more than laying down your life for them. Yeah. Particularly when it comes to women. And apparently soccer is supposed to be moved by that. Huh? Yeah, yeah, all right. Zip it. Yeah, just <laughs> Yes, yeah, so I guess deal with all that later. You've had some luck, but now I'm angry, little boy. Ready to fight now, huh? Okay, now you're talking. Yeah, show us what you got, lady. <laughs> yeah, he's hiding with that resin gun. Okay, and he got her. I think, right? Wait, did I get her? Yeah, it's like, did he? Oh, we we all know. It's like it seems like they got him, but nah. I don't get it. I'm almost positive I tagged her. <laughs> Earth style, hidden in stone jutsu. Water style. Mouth oh, water. <gasps> she got fire and water. Mixed with earth, like yo. Yeah, that is crazy though, like she can just mix herself in with the terrain. Yeah, look at that. Just cloaks herself. Lightning style. And lightning. What? what? I get A. Hey, she only needs one more, right? What? Oh, and, oh that's it. End of the episode. All right, yeah, there we go, all four. So yeah, he has been waiting for Sora, okay. Yeah, how does he know him? Okay. So no, nah, actually we are going to uh, really interact with him. I thought he had to deal with those tombs first. Yeah, I thought that was the main reason. Those three were, um, you know, basically occupying us right now. But, no, nah, I guess he got some other plan, I guess. But, hey, man. It, it won't be no difficulty. Like, I mean, Naruto, he being difficult right now. But, I'm just saying, like, you know, if she want to kiss, I mean, I'm just saying, like, I... Hey man, take my chakra, do whatever. Hey man, anytime, any day. <laughs> That's all I'ma say. Um, not but for real though. Yeah, that boy Sai. Yeah, he already knew. And actually, yeah, what do he do? Like substitute, right? Yeah, cause or either that or he already had the clone made. Cause like I don't think I'm pretty sure she would have noticed if he took off the bag and then put it on another clone or something um or she didn't notice then yeah that could work as well he just had the clone switched up and then he yeah, just go on from there but yeah good that he noticed that because yeah that was actually like very silent it's like yeah i definitely would not even be able to notice that it's like she just through it, it's st stuck onto his bag. But yeah, for him to detect that, that is definitely pretty good. Um,
but yeah they do have the message here and it's like I don't know, Tsunade should know by now, like, if it's a D-rank, C-rank, maybe even a B-rank mission, there's always going to be some trouble. It's like, these ninja aren't gonna be like your just average, everyday ninja that you can just beat up, right? You know, especially what I'd be looking at in these filler episodes, because yeah, I still gotta finish the OG Naruto. Yeah, I'm getting close to being done with that, and then yeah, now, or um, after that, it's... Then it'll just be straight, ship it in, and yeah, just going from there. But like, yeah, those filler episodes, it's like, yeah, Naruto literally beats them up in like one attack. Like, it's no effort. Um, And then you, you know, like, look at this. These aren't no one attack, just one and done enemies, right? Like, they literally have the power to change the literal entire ch terrain of an open field so just to have the power to do that they're not just going to be some easy opponents to beat um and especially the guy yamato went against it's like sort of similar to soccer at least for like the punching like yeah really strengthening that fist so that he could do a lot more damage unless that's just simply his own power um but i can see it like shining like on his face his body is like he has some type of crystal like type of thing um some type of hardening right to where it's like yeah regular kunai is even strong enough to um at least do something to him like nah it just literally falls off um but, but like I said, like, unless you're like Shikamaru doing that strategy, um, and you ain't got to be Shikamaru. I'm just saying, like, if you do a strategy similar th to that in general, um, it's like kunais aren't going to be that powerful. Like, honestly, unless you reinforce them with like the wind nature chakras, whatever, or chakra. Well, yeah, same thing. Yeah. Uh, when nature chakra is like really not doing much <laughs> that's all i'm gonna say um but yes yeah, i um i understand he's trying to learn but it's like probably do all of that after we're done with the mission because yeah, I don't think Sakura was moved at all. She was just, I guess, probably happy that she, I won't even say, well, yeah, not even saved, I guess, right? Like, really more so just, okay, Sai is here. So, you know, at least I got a teammate with me, right? I feel like that's the only thing she'd probably be relieved on. Um... But yeah, let's just see how Naruto deals with her. I mean, literally four natures. I'm like, yeah, see two so far, but it's like now you got three, now four. Like, yeah, either there's a trick to that or not. Nah, that's just simply her having that many natures. Like, um, you know, Kakashi, he did not say that it just couldn't be done. Um, no one said that. It's just probably be very difficult. But I'm just going to end it off here. Yeah, these are some definitely good episodes. Yeah, I like it. These new four characters that we have here. And then, yeah, they're just still spying on Donzo. But besides all that, though, I hope you guys did enjoy. Make sure you like, subscribe again, and I will see you guys in the next one.